Hello, one and all. Welcome to the Galaxy Magic Channel here. Um, just today, chilling out, relaxing, um, because tomorrow I got a, a shift, a Sunday shift, um, doing more trolleys on Sunday because I want to earn more cash before New Year's Eve comes around, before Christmas comes around. Um, haven't done weekend shifts. I'm not really used to doing weekend shifts because it's too much and it's too in the heat. Um, but I'm going to try my best. Um, that's all I can do. Uh, so today's just a relaxed day. And then tomorrow I'm heading to work on the weekend, which is going to be fun and exciting. What? <laughs> um, but oh well, doing it for my mum uh, to make her proud um, so I can make uh, some cash um, before um, Christmas to come and before New Year's Eve to come. Uh, and yeah, pretty much. And then uh yeah uh really excited uh to bring out new projects to come on the galaxy Mantra channel feeling a bit crook at the moment right now um there's a bit of a flu going around um which really really sucks but uh what can i say so i've been been watching like lo a lot of shows at the moment um i've been watching uh merlin the old series merlin i love merlin merlin is the best i'm on to season three right now um which is really awesome i've been oh yeah i got uh yesterday i got uh these two seasons of dollhouse um i got told to watch dollhouse um and basically i just finished the first disc of season one of dollhouse uh i'm on to the second uh disc now and what can i say dollhouse is so freaking brilliant you would not believe like my favorite probably person in dollhouse at the moment is probably echo she's like one badass chick who knows how to fight and things which is epic so whoever hasn't seen dollhouse get into dollhouse like immediately get into dollhouse because it's one truly amazing show so i am thankful that um to get into Dollhouse uh, season one, uh, there's only two seasons uh, and it's super brilliant so far. Um, so loving it. And then I'm going to start off with the Blacklist. Uh, I'm going to start watching the Blacklist after Dollhouse. Um, and then basically um, more Star Trek comes in January, uh, Star Trek Discovery. So I can't wait for that to come back. Uh, the mid season of Once Upon a Time, season seven, the winter finale uh, comes out today, so what? Being, got so going to watch that today, uh, which I'm really excited about. Uh, it's actually, I have to say, once upon a time, season seven has been so brilliant so far. It really has, like the storytelling and everything has been so brilliant so far. Yeah, there's been some episodes that probably could be better, but. I love the direction how Once Upon a Time has been for this season of this new kind of reboot kind of for Once Upon a Time, which I really love, like, because it's without Emma, um, the leader, uh, basically the one that reunited heroes and villains together um, in the Disney world together. Uh, and I just love Once Upon a Time. Once Upon a Time is a brilliant show and the creators are so brilliant at what they do. Uh, and I, I'm loving season seven so far. So I'm really happy to see where this all leads out um, in the winter finale um, with uh, Rapunzel and uh, that witch lady, whatever her name is, like, I forgot. It's the one with the orange kind of hairish chick. Uh, we get to see Zelina come back. So I'm super excited to see Zelina come back. Um, we get to see her daughter, Robin, uh, which is going to be epic. It's going to be like a witch battle. So I'm really excited to see what, what that happens, what happens with that. Um, book, uh, captures someone, this chick, the little thing, the chick with the orange hair, the witch with the orange hair. Um, pardon me that I don't know her name, but yeah, um, overall loving Once Upon a Time season seven. Uh, and yeah, pretty much. So I can't believe I've got work tomorrow, as I said before, but, uh, please wish me luck if you all see this video. Um, 
uh, it's just like a quick random message for you all that to letting you know that I won't be online tomorrow um, because of work, uh, weekend work, which sucks completely. But uh, what can I say? Summer is here. Hooray. Exciting. Not. It's really not. Like summer right now sucks because I'm not used to the heat. The heat gets to my head and it just, my skin for some reason, it gets all really weird and really flustered and yeah, pretty much. You can tell like, because of this flu that's going around, it's, it's because of the weather too. It's just, I don't know. I don't know how to explain it. Like the, the heat for some reason, whenever the, when, whenever summer comes in Australia, in Brisbane, it's like, really like, why does summer have to come? Why does summer have to come because like seriously like i think the reason why i have this flu is because i'm not used to the heat weather I'm, i can i can get used to the cold but i'm not used to the heat and it's so scorching hot you would not believe like seriously it's so scorching hot right now you would not believe even uh, even i'm sitting in my room and it's and i'm sweating it sucks it literally sucks because of this heat it just sucks. Um, but overall, um, keep positive, people. Uh, and I will see you all on the flip side. Bye for now.